I am still in Arches National Park. So I've done my uh, little hike, which was further back up there. I'm just uh, chilling here in a little minute, just making a coffee. Made a coffee and I'm going to uh, cut that. Let's check that out. What do you think of that? It's got a lot quieter now with uh, obviously come to the end of the weekend, Sunday. So I'm going to um, make my way back. Back to the go back and get my trailer on, find a hotel, and um, and go from there. Early night tonight, just gonna go out, have so much to eat, get showered because I stink like Gandhi's flip flop. Seriously, it was pretty hot up there. It was like 25 or so. It all together was five mile, uh, two and a half in, two and a half out. Obviously, five mile. But so you double back on yourself. It doesn't go around in a circle like the girl told me she fibbles. But uh, it was definitely 100% worth it. Look at that. Look at this up here. Is that high mountain? The guys down further down there are climbing this. This has got to be my second most favourite now. That was really worth the hike. That was uh, up there. I'll put the pictures up on Facebook and what have you. There's more videos. I don't think the camera's going in properly. There we go. Obviously they do rafting down here in summer, but that finishes in September. Definitely need to have a go at that sometime. So let me jump in the truck and we'll uh, I'll go further up the road here and you can see what this road's like. It's out absolutely outstanding. It really is. Yeah, we're beeping, I've got my lights on. Okay. Yeah, met some great people up there, had the crack, had a laugh, uh, it's nice. There's camping just up here as well, if you were wondering while camping, I've just gone past, so that look fun. Look at this, this is. Like I've mentioned before, the great thing about, I can take the truck basically anywhere, because, um, because they accommodate for RVs, and uh, there's always big parking, so I can always get in, not with the trailer, you know, I don't want to be dragging that thing about, look, there's the climbing up there. I met one guy who was struggling to get down off a steep bit he'd gone up, but uh, he managed in the end, it was a bit nerve-wracking at uh, times, but he did it. He didn't have any ropes or anything, a bit dumb actually going up without any ropes, but that's how he did. I love the outdoors, early. Uh. <laughs> wow, that's looking looking dodgy up there. <laughs> Maybe I don't need to try the climbing bit. I'm okay going up. I ain't got a problem with that up bit. It's the down bit. You can't see where my little feet are going. What a beautiful drive this is. There's all the park rangers there. What's going on there? Park rangers, all of them. A whole brigade of them. It's well looked after, you know, out here. You've got to remember, when you get out here on some of these trails, that was a, a, a popular trail. I will say to people, but if you do go on a trail that's not a regular used one or something, and you get off trail and you want to go hiking somewhere, it doesn't matter whether it's here, in Europe, England, wherever, especially out here, uh, if it says private property, don't go in it. If you see a cabin out in the middle of nowhere and you come across it, an old caravan or cabin or something, don't go popping up and uh, knocking on the door and see if you want a cup of tea. There's a reason why them people live out there. They don't want to be seen. They don't want to, see, well, they don't, don't want to be disturbed, otherwise they'll live in the town. You know what I mean? So just don't forget the carry guns. Uh, just, just, just walk on by and keep going. That's the best bet. You know, you might get the friendly ones, but uh, I've always thought there's a reason why they live out there. So I just bear that in mind. And they're usually redneck hillbillies anyway. So that's me heading to the hotel. Shower, nice steak. 
bed up at 3.30, crack on again. So it's been a wonderful time, I've really enjoyed it in the, uh, in the park. Arches National Park, remember that one? It's a biggie is that, that rock looks a bit curious up the top of there. Loads to do, plenty to do, no beach but plenty of other things to do. So if you wanted to get out there and explore, this is the place for you. See you all later, bye bye.